right. Day 21. Three weeks in. Crazy. Let's see, see what's new. Good morning. It's 8.11 and it's Wednesday. Nice. Alright, nothing really to speak of. But she found her missing sock behind her washing machine. That's, that's good. That's good, I guess. <laughs> so we've learned today that she has favorite sock. Oh yeah, my house has changed. Now my house looks like this. I like it. I like it. Uh, oh right, I got a couple of these KK blues. So I can just hang one up, I think. Yeah, I like the KK Blues. I'm happy that I, that I got that. It's a choice to buy. And same here. So because I've unlocked the uh, achievement here, you can use your right joystick and just click it down and it'll auto-seek it. Just save some time. Gold hair transformer. Huh. Finish remodeling your house. Looks completely new house. Oh, so you have to keep remodeling your house. Interesting. Hmm. Alright, so let's check our beach. And see what DIY we get today. And we're going to try and finish uh, getting ketchup too as well. We're going to kick Glory out. Cherry blossoms falling are nice and all, but like, it makes it harder to find actual cherry blossoms, I find. Because they kind of blend in with the, with the ones falling, and if you're running, you'll run past like an actual cherry blossom and then it disappears. <laughs> That's the egg DIY. I don't really care too much for that because we have it completed already. We're more or less just waiting for this egg day to end so we get our our last uh, last DIY. Hmm. All right, let's summon ketchup. See what music we have. Oh, Agent KK, it's one we don't have actually. Place a couple of those. I don't think we have this language. Sure, I've never seen a bike in here yet, so. I'll order one of those. Hmm. Let's see what fences we have. Alright, not really any cool fences. The Zen fence looks pretty cool, but I haven't seen it yet. Alright, here we go. Let's get catch up here for the third day. Ketchup. 
wonder if there's one named Mustard. It's just like a yellow, yellow character. Or Relish, It'd be like some sort of green character. Oh, I should give the hot dog suit to ketchup. That's what I should do. Yeah, I'm gonna, <laughs> once I get ketchup here and starts accepting gifts, I'll, I'll give her the hot dog suit. Oh, we spent 20 days apparently on the island. Because I guess it doesn't count your current day because it's not over yet. So we're currently in day 21, but we finished day 20. Oh, right, is there any black roses? Uh, doesn't look like it. Not there, at least. We're listening to some blues today. I like it. And then tomorrow we have Agent KK. Yo, what's up, Ketchup? Here I am. Thanks so much for inviting me. Cardboard boxes. That requires two cardboard boxes. I wonder if I have two. Ooh. Might have to look around my island for that. There's one in the recycling for sure. Huh. So I need a cardboard box. I need two. That's one. Let's go check our storage. See if we have any in storage. I hope we do. So I don't really know any other way to make cardboard boxes. Regardless, I'm gonna <clears throat> finish it, because I can find somebody online that'll just give me a cardboard box, probably. We have one. Do we have... Oh, we have a bunch. What am I talking about? We're good. Whew. check to see if our black rose produced a gold rose because apparently you only need one black rose so that's what I'm testing out Pathway to your incline yesterday. I did. Here's your small cardboard boxes. Mm -hmm. 
clothesline pole. moving out, you know? So it looks like a uh, cat is moving in now. Oh, she's one of those people, one of those just loves the, loves the gnomes. I wonder if because they're the same size as her, you know? Itty bitty ketchup. Alright. Uh, so let's see what else is new. Silly to get our one DIY on the beach. I'm thinking I should maybe build a bridge right here. Instead of having this little hop jump here. regular shadow. Oh, there's a bottle. Nice. I was walking around yesterday picking up DIY stuff and I came up with a great recipe. Alright. Stone table. I already have that. But it is a table DIY so I'm assuming somebody will probably want it. Gotta go get our four fossils. Oh, we got a gold nugget. Nice. We need ten of those. And after that, I just need a whole bunch of rusted parts. Then I can build one robot. But yeah, how's everybody's day going if you're watching this on YouTube later? What else is over here? Oh, is that a purple? Looks like a purple. Is that the elusive purple rose or purple, uh... Yeah, it is a purple pansy. Crazy. Huh. Those are, like, supposed to be super hard to get, but I guess this just produced just properly. And yeah, I made a purple there. That's cool. I like it. Oh yeah, is this a fucking gold rose? No. No gold roses. But we do have a path back here now though. It's kinda cool. Yeah, 
Got a fossil. Watered that with our gold watering can. Looks like most of our food is coming, which is nice. And I have actually seen that you can actually do more money in there, and there's a small chance that it'll actually be above the 10k. So there's a chance. But the 10k is always guaranteed. But anything above it, it's just a chance, it seems. I saw a video of somebody who got like 50, 51 k I believe. Oh! You're CJ, aren't you? Yeah. around my uh, my area oh there's an item down there Item, nice. I hear a balloon. Ah, uh, just a regular balloon. I mean, a egg balloon. Nice. We've been pretty, pretty lucky at finding all the fossils. We have three. Piper's always losing stuff. This is the second thing she lost. Oh, that's just a regular balloon. Alright, that's cool. Lost an umbrella. I don't think we have that yet. Nope. Nice. That's cool. Alright, we're 
we're definitely gonna have to do a CJ fishing fishing tournament. See see what that's all about. I heard you have to get something like 300 points in a day, and you would get the gold gold medal or something. tree. Actually, no, let's cut down the tree in the back where, where we just uh, got the money and plant the money tree up there. Another present or another present balloon somewhere. Where is the Ah, yeah, there it is, just a regular, regular old egg balloon. See if she's crafting anything. Oh nope, she's still just waking up. Say hi. Hmm, our first big event. What's our first big event? Oh, I guess the Easter. Easter event, probably. Alright, but we got ketchup here. It's cool. And let's see. The three out of the four fossils. Let's see what the nooklings are selling today. Oh, an actual digital clock. That's actually kind of cool. I like that. And I've heard, I think, some things require books and maybe magazines to craft. So, it's good to at least purchase one of those. Screen. Oh. Yeah, so hopefully in the next uh, week or something we'll have the upgraded nook nook center here. Hmm. Yeah, crafted crafted a bunch of bait yesterday. I didn't think CJ's was today though, I thought it was Saturday. Yeah, upcoming fishing tourney. So fishing tourney planned for Saturday, April 11th. So CJ is not a fishing tourney then, it's just handing stuff in? Hmm. Interesting. Uh, so we 
got it that. Let's go see if we can find our last fossil and drop some stuff off. And this one's a pink rose, so we're gonna put that on our rose, uh, which one call it? Rose waterfall. Perfectly, nice. I was hoping that was the case. Alright, so we're looking for our last fossil. Wherever could that be? Roses here. Is that a pink rose? Oh, oh hey, you lost something too. I was looking for you. Huh. Oh, is it a bag anyway? <laughs> I'll find it for you. It's right here. <laughs> Talk to you again. Already? Piper's always losing stuff, it seems. Oh, it's a chef's outfit. Cool. That's actually kind of neat. I like that. Totally gonna throw that on right now. Alright, neat. I like it. One more DIY and just change our wardrobe. Oh, good news. Now the residents get along. Huh. So I guess I'm true friends with Piper now. That's cool. Need to make one more true friend. Neat. Alright. Yeah, this looks like a pink rose. Yeah, it was a pink rose. So why did a pink rose produce with just red roses? Huh. person see if they're they're crafting anything. Nope, but they're eating their morning sandwich, <laughs> which they were yesterday actually. Looks like it has tomatoes again and huh. really wanted to say here, have a piano. <laughs> Alright, 
let's go plant these pink roses. Oh, and there's another big spot up here too. Last fossil, thanks. Then we have one more rock right around this bend that we need to hit. One more rock in our town square. And I guess while we're here, we might as well just harvest our cherries. This will be another 80k in the bank, I think, with all the fruit from this and the peaches. It's nowhere near as many as we used to have. I think if you go into day three of the stream, there was... I think I had like 50... 50 cherry trees, 50 peach trees. Those were the days. Then you talk to Isabel and she's like, Your place is too rustic. It has too many trees and the residents are getting lost and they can't attend their favorite TV show. I had to chop, chop, chop. Now I have this wonderful waterfall here, so it was, it was all worth it. have anything that can use pears for crafting. So those are also gonna get sold. the way my island turned out though, it's actually pretty cool. I think we can actually retire our full bulb. We don't really need our full bulb anymore. Hey Nick, how's it going? It's Wednesday. 
swear if it wasn't for this game, I wouldn't know what day it was sometimes. Yeah, we got we got ketchup here today, so we did our day three of three of the amiibo, so tomorrow she should be moving in. I kicked out Gale. Gale's moving out. Nice, yeah, this I have CJ here today. It's kinda cool. Yeah, this game is highly addictive. It at least keeps you keeps you active for at least a good portion of the day. Oh, do I have that bug? Okay, there's one bug here that's just a rare spawn. Yeah, I do have that one, the citrus, citrus one. There's supposed to be a new tree bug from Chop Trees that spawn in April. see Texas place now too because Texas now uh, moved in you have run out of space nope huh all right I guess we should go sell some stuff and actually let's go say hi to Klaus let's see if he's crafting anything Gotta go say hi to Klaus in his house. Oh, and he is crafting something. Alright, cool. What you doing, Klaus? An ironwood bed. Ooh, ironwood. Nice. I like that. Teach me. Teach me your ways, Klaus. Though you forgot, at least you wrote it down. <laughs> What does that look like? Oh, that looks like an, just like an actual bed. Huh, neat. That's cool. Alright, so we did that. Let's go sell because we can make a room. I think we can hold six more pairs. Let's see what turnip prices are actually. 147. That's actually not too bad. I have a few turnips I still need to sell. That's pretty good. Nice. Yeah, I spent, I think, yeah, I spent one million bells on turnips and I actually sold two batches of them yesterday, I think, or two days ago. That's, I made 
made, I think, three million? <laughs> and paid off all my debt. But I still have a little bit left, but... Because there's, there's some items that cost, like, one million bells, and they're super rare to show up. But when they do, like, kind of want to... I don't know, I want to get them at least. Wow, one more team. Yeah, and there's actually a turnip, uh, turnip site, so it's turnip.exchange, I think. That's a good one for, like, selling turnips. Um, you kind of just wait in line and, yeah, just as long as you're there, when your queue comes up, you can just sell your fossils, or sell your, <laughs> sell your turnips. <laughs> Apparently somebody made, like, a prediction site where you can, like, put in what your current prices are for the week and I'll kind of predict on when your next... When the next big uh, price will come on your island, which is kind of neat. Seems like turnips are the way if you wanna, if you wanna make a quick, quick bell in this game. Gotta, gotta join the turnip market. Oh, we got one. So we have three that we already had. I like when there's at least one new fossil. Which it seems most of the time it is. Teach me bladders. How do you say that? Co Coprolites? Coprolites? Huh. Fossilized feces. Gross. Alright. The coprolite from certain plant-eating dinosaurs have been found to contain small pebbles. Huh. One thing I wish they had in this game that they don't is all the things that you've caught. Like it's cool that it says like like where you caught it and when you or when you caught it. But it'd be neat if it actually said, like, uh, a little spiel on, like, what it is, you know, kind of what Blather says. Like, if you read this and it kind of gave you some information on the goldfish, you know, that'd be kind of neat. Instead of just saying, hey, these were caught on this day, donated by so-and-so. Or if there's, like, another option to just, like, read more or something. That'd be a cool little, little update. Alright, so we did our fossils. And we still have a couple peach trees to shape. And yeah, we have good old good old ketchup here today. Replacing Gale. And I'm gonna give her a hot dog suit. <laughs> I like that you can dress up your villagers. It's kind of neat. Like I gave Klaus a soft serve golden hat. It just looks like a golden turd and he's like, I love it. I'm going to wear it immediately. <laughs> God, there's so much music in this game though, it's crazy. Oh yeah, we still have to do a CJ thing. Gotta do that once. Yeah, my turn of prices are ever actually pretty high though. I'm, I wouldn't mind like opening it up to people. Just do like a dodo code. Because it changes in the morning and it changes in the afternoon. And I also heard recently that apparently there's a thing called pitfall seeds. So it'll just kind of look like a thick spot but when you walk over it, you fall into it. And if you ever find one, apparently the store also sells it every so often, but if you plant it and then dig it up again, your guy will be like, Hey, I found a pitfall seed. 
I now know it. I have a DIY thing for this, and then you'll learn how to craft your own pitfalls. To try and get rid of those unwanted villagers. Alright, so we got all that. Uh, let's leave that there, I guess. And let's go get our fishing rod and do this fishing tournament thing. Fishing chef. Yeah, I'm happy that my that my house changed though. It's cool you can change the outsides. I wish you could put DIYs in the storage. Second fishing rod. And I should have some fishing bait here as well that I crafted. Alright, so we're gonna go do this fishing tournament. Although it's not the fishing tournament, it's just CJ. So I'm guessing the tournament is different. Donate three, three fishies to him to get a uh, get a statue though. That'd be kind of cool. Win and I'll make it rain. Talk to you about the stream. Huh. I catch five fish in a row, any kind is good. Yuck, yuck. So there's no time resist, this isn't the, the thing where I need to actually get the, uh, whatchamacallit, use my fish bait. Oh no, I hate it when it's out. Okay, okay. Nice, that's one. Oh no, never mind, it's just an egg. <laughs> so much for the challenge, nothing to do but start again. We need to catch five fish in a row. And hopefully they're not all egg fish. Alright, maybe I will use my bait just because, yeah, these, these egg things are ridiculous.
Okay, now it's definitely one fish. I think I have that one yet. Cool. Ah! Broke the streak, man. Damn. <laughs> Let's start again. Jeez. Jeez Louise. Again, that's one, one fish. Ooh, that's a big fish there. Well, not really. It's a medium fish. for number four. Ah, it's so <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, it's a big fish. It's a big fish. Let's try a sea bass. This is fishing fails 101. Get up there and <laughs> it's like, oh, we're so close, we're so close. And nope. Alright, two out of five. Patience is a virtue. God, I'm so bad at this. I get to four and then it's just like, oh my God. <laughs> All right, this time we're doing it 100%. 100% we got this this time.
We're trying this for like our third time, we're at 3 out of 5 again. Oh my god. That's uh, a big fishy, I think. One more. Whew, no big deal. No big deal. No big deal. We got this. We got this. Yay! We did it. Finally. Oh my god. We're gonna make CJ make us the probably the water fish, the one that comes in the water. I think I have three of those around the island. Everything except for that yellow fish. <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah, so the fishing tourney that's this Saturday. That's cool. Alright, so we did that. Uh, let's go ahead in this A or this fishy. Oh, and it's 9 o'clock, so that means the thing's open already. Cool. All right, we're gonna get our these things. We're gonna get three of those fishies. I never got it yet. Yeah, butterfly fish, nice. Sure. The butterfly fish is just charming with its beautiful colors and elegant movements. Refer to it as a butterfly fish, but in actually a grouping in which there are over a hundred types. Flutter back and forth some, some neat stuff. Now we gotta go find our three colocants or whatever. Is that one fish? Colocants. Which we should have one up here by the shop. Fish actually looks pretty bad. Yes, ah, choices. Colocants or or fish. Mm. 
I like this because it's like a shelf. Because that would be crazy to get a statue of that, I think. Um. Although I like that the ore fish is like in like its own little, own little pool, you know. But... Yeah, we gotta gotta do some cleanup here. So that's two. We're gonna do an ore fish. Ore fish today. Pelicanth maybe. Next time he shows up. So let's put this put this back. Uh yeah you can if you or if you have the mats, I don't mind like crafting it for you if you want. The golden watering can is really only needed if you have black roses. Black roses are kind of what it's needed for. But yeah, if you want me to craft one for you though, I don't I don't mind crafting one. Just let me know. And I'll I'll open up my place. Let's see, I have another ore fish over here. Ah, uh, but this one's like my pool. It's my pool outside. Uh let's see. I think it's just one one gold in a watering can. If you have rusted parts, I'm looking for those, but it's not needed. Yeah, it's just one gold nugget and the watering can. Still trying to build my robot. Let's see, what was I doing? Oh yeah, the color is the ore fish. I think I have one more over here, yeah. Cool, yeah, yeah, I'll open up my place here then. Just let me... Handing these fish to CJ. Alright. Yeah, just let me message when you're back to the chat and I'll, I'll open it up. Make me a collection. Ooh, nice. Three big ore fish. I wonder what this will look like. Because you can only get one statue whenever they visit. Oh, Neat. That's cool. Yeah, so you can only, you can only do those once. Once a tight day. I figured that out with the butterfly. I was gonna get the cool, like, the... The Emperor Butterfly, but I figured out you could only do one and I didn't end up getting the Paper Butterfly. Oh look, he's playing it! That's neat. Oh, he lost. Oh, he's a quitter. He's like, I lost, I'm done. I'm done with that. Okay, so we're not doing the fishing tournament yet, that's this Saturday. I haven't seen like any videos of people getting an oarfish statue. 
let's deposit a hundred thousand bells. Oh yeah, we're supposed to actually check our uh, our shop because we have the clothing shop open. Before we go spending all our money, let's see. What's up, Babel sisters? Alright, so you're back. Welcome back, Nick. Ooh, so we have Halo. Ah, and Tex is here, that's cool. Alright, let's do a quick check, see what's in here. And then yeah, I'll open up open up my place and I can craft you craft you that golden watering can. Bulldog jacket. That looks kind of cool, actually. I like it. Uh, oh, you got some soccer uniforms. It's kind of neat. Some flashy slacks. <laughs> oh, we have a pilot's pilot's uniform. Oh, we have like a witch's hat or something. That's pretty cool, actually. Or the uh, which we call it warlock hat, I guess. Oh, and we can get the black tiny glasses. Yeah, there's actually some cool stuff here. Neat. Alright, so I'm gonna go open up go open up my place. I see a little picture of a dog on the back. That's neat. Yeah, I couldn't imagine like the bigger streamers like opening it up to people <laughs> because they're gonna get spammed with so many things. Uh, invite via Dota code. Oh, I didn't want to do that. No, nope. I want to be more the merrier. No, nope. no, nope. I don't care. Yeah, if we open it. It's the wrong code. Don't worry about that. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, we need to redo that because shows the wrong thing. All right, new code coming up. New code coming up. Yeah, online. Roger. Like, I wish you can, like, pre-select, like, some of these options, and it's just like, alright, so we're gonna do this, 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 and this, and alright. Now it's open. Uh, so I'm gonna invite via Dodo. We want to do more than the Mary. Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah cool. Glasses make my eyes look like they're like all looking in different directions. <laughs> He's like looking at you from the corner of his eye. <laughs> I'm just gonna listen to some blues music while we wait. Yeah, yeah, so like that's all it costs and if you want to bring like 
rusted parts if you're willing to. It's nice, otherwise, yeah, just come on over and craft it for you. One gold nugget, then one watering can. I'm happy I got this blues music, actually. Some of my villagers will just start singing it, so it'd be kind of neat. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. It's understandable. If you have any cool furniture, because... I don't, know. I don't really need anything though, I'm willing just to, just to craft it for ya. Gift's kind of cool, yeah? Always neat, neat having gifts. That rusted part grind though, you know. <laughs> what I've been doing is I've been seeing Gulliver, but I haven't been helping him. I've just been digging up the five communicator parts, and then the next following day, the five parts will become rusted parts. Then you get five rusted parts as opposed to if you help him you'll get one rusted part in the recycling bin. And maybe other days too I'll do like other crafting stuff if people people want to craft it, because like I can do a lot of different crafting. There's like a wooden mini table. Apparently tables are very, like, hard to get. I have like a bunch of, bunch of stuff I can craft now though. Got the ironwood bed today, that looks slick. Ironwood low table, it's kinda neat. I have a bunch of star patterns here. Apparently this crescent moon chair is very coveted, people want that a bunch. I have most of the Sakura stuff for the cherry blossom. And then yeah, all the egg DIY stuff. All crafted. Just waiting for the end of bunny day. Yeah, with, with the Celeste patterns though, you can only get those one a day. So if you go to somebody else's island, you can talk to Celeste and she'll give you a DIY. But if you see her on multiple islands, she'll still only just... She won't give you any more, just, just that one. But man, I'm happy with this hat though. I like that I got it. Yeah, bells are fine. I said which whichever you want to bring over doesn't doesn't really matter to me. Just willing to help somebody out. This game's more about just helping people I find rather than like trying to take everything from the other person to make it so they have nothing. Cause I got some I met a couple nice people and they're able to craft me the the rocket and the gold armor. So I have two rockets and I have, or I have three rockets and two gold armor. So I just need the rusted parts and the gold gold nuggets, I think. And then I can craft a uh, robot. Oh, it's a balloon. It's a balloon. It sounds like an egg balloon, though. Yeah, it's just an egg balloon. Yeah, I enjoy just helping out the community.
Yeah, sadly I don't. I don't have the DIY for the rocket or the... Or the gold armor. Still searching for that, but I found... Found people who did have it. And the turnip.exchange is actually where I got the gold armor crafted. So people are using that site for also, like, crafting stuff for people and Celeste. It's more or less just like a line management tool, it seems. So people open up their island, then it'll limit like two people to have the code and then once they leave the queue it'll allow the other people to enter the queue so it's a really well designed site for this this game because you can just enter the queue and just kind of i don't know watch a show or something and just kind of keep an eye on it and once it's your turn you just jump in line and do your thing but yeah i wish i had the, the diy for those for the rocket Rocket and the gold armor. Not yet. But it, I'm pretty sure most days you can find at least some gold armor crafter on the turnip.exchange site. Some will say, oh, pay me 50 grand and I'll craft your armor, which sometimes it's worth it, you know? Because to find those DIYs yourself are pretty. Pretty ridiculous, it seems. Pretty RNG heavy. <laughs> ah, <laughs> yeah, we're just chilling here, listening to some blues while we wait. So I think I finished pretty much all my dailies already. My town map, though. Look at that. Wow. Look at all those paths. It's very well placed, I think. Oh, actually, Nick, if you have extra black roses, you can bring one black rose over. That'd be nice, actually. Kitchen table? I think I do. I think I have... Uh, I don't have all the parts for it, though, but I have the ironwood kitchenette beneath the ironwood dresser, which I don't have the dresser yet. I don't have an ironwood dresser. I have a cutting board, though. I can do the cutting board crafting, which that's also pretty, pretty rare. I actually traded a crescent moon chair for it. Yeah, the cutting board. This is needed for, it's like a base mat for a few of the ironwood stuff. Yeah, awesome. Thanks, Nick. One black rose, that'd be awesome. Because I spent, I think, the past three days without any black roses. A couple pink ones, but no, no black ones. Just my one. At least with two black roses, they have a chance to produce also another black rose. So I have two that'll help kind of keep it moving. Then they also have a chance to spawn a gold rose if you water them with a gold watering can. So. Yeah, I can make you whatever you want, Nick. Just bring bring the parts on over and yeah, that's, that's all I need. Oh, you want me to make you two? It's only a couple hardwood, unless you don't don't have the hardwood and the iron nuggets. I don't mind like crafting stuff if people people bring the materials. There's a lot of stuff I can craft. It's also the, an orange table, which is neat. Or this uh, palm tree lamp. I don't think many people have this, to be honest. It's pretty, pretty rare, just along the lines of like the coconut juice. Not many people have that yet. Oh, you can actually color the sakura or the blossom lantern huh hmm. 
Oh, it's a regular balloon. Nice. Oh no, <laughs> just as you're coming. <laughs> That's so bad luck. Because then the balloon disappears. Because, yeah. Yeah, I can craft, uh, I can craft a gravestone thing. I can do like a zen, zen stone as well, and a mossy, mossy stone. Some DIYs. I think it's like the branch. It's like a blossom branch. Don't know what that's for. Maybe to hit your villagers with and it just looks like a fancy stick. <laughs> Gravestone things I can like craft. Cause that's the. What is it? Yeah, there's this one stone tablet, I guess. Zen style stone. But then there's also a mossy garden rock. There are a couple other things I can craft. I like that, that emotion. Awesome, nice. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let me drop my watering can just so I don't. Let's see. Drop. I'm just dropping that just so I can craft yours and not get it mixed up. Uh, let's see. Do I have a golden? Yeah, I have my golden one too. So don't pick this up. Let's see. Drop. Let's see. Let me. Let me craft yours. <laughs> I'm just dropping mine so I don't get it mixed up. Uh, let's craft. Cutting board, I think it's two hardwood. Let's see. Let's see. Let's draw. So that's yours. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> okay, uh, cutting board, let's see. Uh, where is it? Cutting board, so two hardwood and one iron nugget. Problemo. The coveted cutting board. <laughs> yeah, and also, actually, I seen a rocket. Somebody was selling a rocket DIY pattern. I think it was like the fourth day this came out or something. Yeah, sure, it's gonna take a walk around. 
Uh, but yeah, somebody was selling the Rocket DIY, and it was, uh, they're selling it for seven, seven Nook Mile tickets. But I never had seven at the time, otherwise I would have bought the DIY, like, right then and there. Yeah, this is, oh, is this guy home now, I think? Yeah, this is my new penguin. Tex. Ah, oh, he has a, oh, wow, this guy, this guy's pumping, man. I can just come to Texas house and, man, this is lit. There's a base or something. Man, Texas is living the life. Nice. <laughs> So he just moved in yesterday and finished unpacking today. So my place is pretty developed. This is like one of my favorite favorite areas right now. This is lovely, lovely waterfall. And there's also this. This is also something I can craft that I don't think many people have. I can craft that. That takes five. Pink, pink Cosmo flowers and some other stuff. A little cherry blossom area for the vent. This will probably change once Bunny Day is over. Oh yeah, there's that. That thing's kind of neat. Uh, this is my apple orchard. Apple orchard right here. And then you can actually walk behind the waterfall, which is kind of cool. This is also a nice layer. It has flow because you can just walk right down. So you don't have to worry about like going back. There's that coconut coconut lamp. Uh, this was a good waterfall that I made kind of just to figure out how to make it. Um, a little punching bag. This is another one of my... Most of my villagers are my crazy. Like I like them. Might get rid of the pig. Pig next. Yeah, Dobie. I like Dobie. Yeah, it's just an old, old wolf. <laughs> Such a charming old character, and I've heard that there's not too many old villagers in the game. Yeah, we have a good old little like swimming pool area here. Like a little little seat you can sit here for like stargazing, I guess. <laughs> for like watching the star falls. Kind of like my own little area. It's cool when you see villagers use those things. <laughs> Another cool little waterfall that I made. So one thing is you can't actually go behind it, it's impossible. So you have to jump across to actually get to the other side. And that's made just so you can't go behind here, so you have to take that little path. That's really about it. It's a neat little hop. Or you can do the ladder, of course. <laughs> This area I like, so you can kind of go over here, and then some more waterfall. Here's CJ. Uh, but you can actually go behind. This is the neat little area that I added, so you can go up the stairs. This is where I'm growing my black roses, and my first five-star flower. So I have a theory that if you water two of these, maybe together with like a golden watering can, Maybe they'll actually reproduce? I don't know. This game took like, I don't know, what is it, like seven years or ten years to make? So, so yeah, so that's that area. I put a little sign there just because I can't actually go back there because there's a chair. But you can go up. You can kind of go around a nice little pond here. 
You can sit on here, I think, yeah. <laughs> little, little stool area. I have a bunch of DIY things just all around too. I think I have them in all four, or pretty much in all corners. Ah, yeah, this one I actually I found out of a balloon. So I can't make it, but I can buy it. So I think that's like 7,000 bells to order. I just like found it from a balloon. <laughs> just, and I, I love the way it looked, so I just kind of, I ordered two of those, I think. Uh, what else, I think? Oh yeah, there's up here, more stairs. This is the moon chair. Ah, you gotta go, I think, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's fine. <gasps> yeah, no problem, mate. No problemo. Awesome. I always like helping out the community. Hey, Ellie. How's it going? How's it going there, Ellie? How you doing this fine Wednesday? Yeah, I'm stoked for tomorrow because I'm gonna get the ore fish, ore fish uh, model. That look kind of neat. Oh yeah, we got the got the gold or got the black rose. So I gotta go plant that. Nice. Oh, I didn't want to dig up those flowers. <laughs> oh my god. Doodling's kind of neat. It's a good way to to spend some time. Boost those creative juices. I've seen some people doodle, and they're like, "That's like, that's a masterpiece. That's not a doodle." <laughs> crazy artists out there. Alright, so we can plant another black rose, I think right here. Alright. Did that water it. Although I don't think it'll reproduce right now because it's not fully budded. There's no point in actually watering it right now. Just because we're limited of uses per watering can. Oh, balloon. Balloon. So just, oh, it sounds like an egg balloon. Yeah, it's just an egg balloon. Alright, yeah, we have all the ore fish cleaned up. Let's see if we still have a five star place. I'm pretty sure we do. So we need to have like five star consecutive days to get that rare five star flower. Hey, five stars! Yay. I'm 
got a real strong feelings for that island. It's such a catch. As soon as I made landfall, I knew I was hooked. Sounds like CJ. Even the scale of the place fools the rest, plus everyone's theirs. Like my chum. Yeah, it's fantastic. Nyak. <laughs> the nyak gave it away. <laughs> All right, so we planted our flower. I guess let's actually go water our, our uh, other roses. To see if we can get other black flowers. And then after we finish watering these flowers, that might... That might be at the stream, I think. We finished all our dailies. We helped somebody out, which is kind of cool. Man, we have so many red roses here. I need to plant some somewhere else, I think. I need to zigzag it. I need to zigzag it. that flower up. Oh, there was actually a rose there, I didn't even know. Ooh, I think I know where those can go, actually. Okay. So we have one other rose area that we have for... for red roses. In case we can get some more black flowers reproducing here. But man, Texas place is nice. Yeah, right here, so we're gonna plant our other roses. Dig that up. Man, I love, I love the waterfall. Alright, oh, there's one more rose that popped up right here, actually. Hopefully we'll get some more black roses from this maybe tomorrow. That'd be nice. Because I really want at least one cobalt. Well, I want a bunch of gold roses. But eventually we'll get get there. Because I think I think I want to put gold roses maybe all along the top of this. This waterfall. And then maybe more pink roses on this side. That's a lot of roses though, but we'll see when we get there. Oh right, we need to do a quick costume change. I 
let's go do that, and then yeah, we'll probably we'll end the stream there. a nice rocket. And it's just a regular egg balloon. Ah, move. Move, Prince. Quick change. So now we officially finished, well, except for the customizing part, but... And that, we finished our dailies. Caught our fish, we handed in our ore fish, uh, we helped Nick get a gold watering can, which was kind of cool. Um, I also hear a balloon over here, actually. I think that's the egg balloon again. Yeah, nothing cool. Yeah, we helped out some people. Finished our house is now different, which is cool. Mm. Yeah, and I think that about does it. Hit our rocks. We got one more gold piece, actually. So how many, how many gold pieces do we have currently? Because we need 10 for one robot. So we have... I have a bunch of bugs here still. Uh, wow, look at that storage. You can have 1600 max when your house is fully upgraded. That's a lot. Uh, oh yeah, so we have four gold nuggets. So I need six more gold nuggets. It's not too bad. Alright, so we'll end it here. And if you're watching this on YouTube later and you enjoy the content, remember to leave a like and subscribe. So until next time.